you found the one, you should never give her up. I think it's the way life changes when in love, yeah. I surround my soul with the positivity. That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see, yeah. These days I don't worry about much. What's up, guys? It's Brennan, and I'm back with another video. And I know I look crazy, but besides the point, happy Saturday. Today is my sister's baby shower, and we are all so excited. My sister's they ain't getting ready. Uh uh, you gotta turn the music off because copyright. It's Jessica's baby shower today. I'm She's getting ready. Done. Rachel's doing her makeup. <laughs> Rachel still gotta put my her head, wig half on. Half of my hair done. <laughs> but it's Bro, jelly I bean. Know. I still got on pajamas. But it's jelly bean party today. Jessica, what? You ain't straightened your hair yet. Half of it. Oh, I see the ha half of it. So clearly, y'all can see that we all um still trying to get ready. Do you need lashes? I got a yes. pack of magnetic lashes or. Where we got regular lashes right here. Rachel came okay. here without her wig. Her wig hasn't been plucked. It has not been. The lace hasn't came off. Got me. Nothing. And she think I'm going to do it for her. Oh, oh my goodness. I started vlogging because I'm letting my concealer dry before I blend it out. If you know, you know. Oh what time is it? Right Ain't it like 12. Oh. The dry by started off at 1, right? Hey, do. But me and what? Ashley, she's having a drive-by baby shower and then an also in-person baby shower. Drive-by baby shower starts at 1. Me and Ashley are in charge of that. And then 3 is when we're having the baby shower, but it's going to be outside, social distancing. Everybody got to have a mask. If you ain't what? never seen the eyebrow. I'm a potato. If you ain't never seen the eyebrow. Me and Ray Ray are literally got the same the eyebrow. Eyebrow. Show the eyebrow. Let me see that eyebrow. Oh yes, eyebrow. I look so cool. We are potatoes. We need the, um, foundation. <laughs> so yeah, Jessica, you don't need no foundation. Yes, I do. No, you don't. You use it at the, like, the I know, and you didn't need it. Yes, I do, man. Especially it when you put your mask out. on, it's gonna mess up your makeup. Trust me. So then, when you take your mask off, you're gonna have a line of where your mask was in your foundation. So you don't need no foundation. Maybe um, she can do a little powder, but a full heavy foundation. Mm -mm. Cause once I put my mask on, that's it until the end because my face gonna look toe up. Um, especially with me and actually being outside. We was worried that it was gonna be raining, but praise the Lord, it's not raining today. It's actually nice and sunny. Y'all can see tables and stuff down there. We gotta, we gotta get that together. But look at Jessica's dress. Jessica, Jessica. Your little short dress. Yeah, it's, kind of short. it's cute though. It's so, see, you gonna look nice. I'm gonna look. You gonna look nice. I'm gonna look like I'm going to church. Cause I'm gonna put on my boots though, cause I ain't wearing no heels. I'm a single auntie, and I'm gonna look like it too. Shut up. We are potatoes. Like boots, high heel boots. She's trying to put on. I saw them. She called me. And I already me. won because I I got the best gifts already. We, we know this already. That's not it's not a competition. Yes, number one. <laughs> Let me go finish my face so I can be ready at twelve to finish helping stuff. All right, guys. I am done getting ready. I was gonna try to show y'all my outfit, but I think the angle that I have, you can't really see. But I just have on this pink, pink. Oh Lord Jesus, I said pink and this dress is clearly yellow. Then I just had to look down at it again to see if it was actually yellow because I said pink. So, pray for me. But I just have on this yellow dress. Um, I got on my boots. Maybe later, later I'll be able to show y'all, but yeah, that's what's happening right now. I'm going to bring this with me downstairs so that I won't have to come back up these stairs. Um, and um yeah maybe i can show you guys all right can y'all see i'm gonna zoom in a little bit hi so yeah this is my dress there is my little sleeve things i feel like a little bit peak with these sleeves just have on my boots because who's meant to wear heels it's me
Knock on door. Dang, Brown, I gotta carry all this stuff. It, it was. It... Hello, this Hello. your neighbor. Hi, Hi, our groceries got delivered to, to the, the wrong, wrong house. house. They right, right here. here. <laughs> <laughs> they right here. Yeah, they delivered our they groceries. They delivered to the wrong house. To I'm the so wrong sorry. house. Oh, here, my phone. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I was like. Yeah, I saw it. Yeah, they so took they a took a picture of your front, and we saw the address. And we zoomed in and saw the address. Saw the address. Okay. Gr oh. Thankful oh. that it was yeah, there. Is that the first one? Huh? Is that the first Usually, time? they come straight you to my house. something more supportive? Yeah, because the bars broke. I but could carry we some been, stuff. We been, uh, right, right, the house right here on this corner or that corner? Uh, uh, one? The one on the left side. Like, left side. right diagonal from you. So, y'all had a... Uh, uh, baby shower or something like that. We yeah, did. We had a baby, <laughs> yeah, we had a baby shower. <laughs> Dang, uh, every, everybody saw that. that. Yeah. <laughs> Dang, yeah, we had a whole baby shower. But thank y'all so much. Thank you so you much. Welcome. Anyway, I'm Sam. This is my wife. Hey, Sam. Hi. Hi. Oh, thank you. That's the only one who had a baby shower. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, oh, congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Y'all have a blessed day. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Right, guys. So as you saw, um, the person who delivered my Instacart groceries, I don't know how. I don't understand how. I don't see how. But I'm trying to give them the benefit of the doubt. But they delivered to the wrong house. They actually delivered to the house that is like diagonally across the street from me. And I just don't understand it because you have GPS. My house is pinned. So you know exactly where to go. And then also GPS. And then also it provides you with my address. So like when you pulled up to 2427 and it wasn't 24 my address, like I would have called or text or something and then they just dropped it off and just left. If I don't understand, but thank God neighbors were super nice. We just, as y'all saw, we went over there and just was like, hey. They delivered to the wrong house. They didn't even know the groceries were sitting out there. I'm guessing the person didn't even ring the doorbell like they were supposed to. So they were just like, huh? Groceries? It was like, yeah, they're right here. <laughs> they delivered to the wrong house. But um, I'm just glad I got my groceries. Because when I walked outside, I thought maybe they stole them. They said that they delivered them, but actually took off with them. But thank God that was not the issue. Um, I have no idea what I'm about to currently do. I was supposed to have movie night with Shaquavia, but she canceled on me. And, uh, so yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do now. I don't want to cook. I've been cooking every day. And today, I just don't feel like cooking. I really do not. I really do not feel like cooking. I think I'm going to get me some Uber Eats. I don't know. Me and William are probably just going to play the game. There's William. Shaquavia canceled on us. I knew it because I'm like, it's getting close to the... I ain't gonna tell her no, Shaquavia. If you watch it, I'm not telling her no more. Oh, you wanna have movie night? I'm gonna let her um, ask. Okay. Because we have planned two movie nights and she don't cancel on both. I'm kidding, but I'm serious. Like it's not that serious, but she she know me, so she get it. Hello, everybody. I was y'all know I was talking trash about her earlier. <laughs> what did they say? What did you say, William? That's not was real the fire. trash talking. Yeah, it's real it's the trash talking house, was that. And they didn't give you a fireplace? I didn't, fired. I didn't. Talking was after she canceled on us. Oh. We're watching the countdown. <laughs> so the countdown is demonic. Yes. The countdown is not And demonic. the quiet place. The whole time? I'm so glad y'all to see that. That was embarrassing. Yeah. You finna die. Ah! Oh my God. <laughs> it's so intense. I love it. Little boy, don't do it. Don't do it. This dummy. <laughs> she can't even look at the She can't even run to him. She's this crying. This little dummy. She know. Like you just about to die. She's, she's going. Talk. She's going. Into oh no! You can't no, no, no. Same thing. What's up, guys? Happy Sunday. I just got done getting completely ready for the day. I am about to have a little mini photo shoot with me and my iPhone and get some pictures and content for Instagram because I haven't posted in a minute. I don't have anything to post, so.
But before I get to that, I'm fixing me something to eat because I'm hungry. Leftovers from yesterday, I made um, fried shrimp and mashed potatoes and then my sister made some macaroni and cheese. So grab some of that. And I'm about to eat while I am at church. But yeah, today is gonna be a really nice chill day. I'm just gonna get me some content for Instagram, probably do some reels. And then tonight, my brother invited me to go with him and my sister in love and my niece and nephew to go see some Christmas lights, like a um, drive through light show here in um, Georgia, in Marietta. So I'm excited about that because it's gonna like put me in the holiday mood. Oh, me and Maddie are watching a movie tonight. Clearly, movies are just my thing. Movies are my love language. <laughs> All right, let's go upstairs. All right, guys, this is my lunch for today. My fried shrimp from last night. Mac and cheese from last night. Mashed potatoes from last night. You know what I'm saying? I'm speaking prophetically to somebody. Don't allow the pandemic to cause you to break your covenant with God of tithing, of sowing, of giving, of trusting. I, I would be lying to you if I didn't tell you that there have been some scary moments during this pandemic for me financially. There have been some frightening moments for the church financially of saying, God, how are we going to do the things we need to do? But I want to tell you, I resolved in my mind I'm going to stay put. If, if where I have been all this time is in the land of trusting God, I'm not leaving that land. If where I've been sojourning is in the place of giving faithfully to God, I'm not leaving that place. If where I've been staying is in the place of tithing every time I get blessed, I'm not leaving that place. God said, I want you to stay there. Verse number 12. Alright guys, I am going to end this vlog here. If you like this video, make sure you like this video. If you haven't already joined the family, if you made it all the way to the end of the outro of this video, you might as well subscribe. Hit that subscribe button and make sure you hit that notification bell so that you get a notification every single time that I upload. And until next time guys, bye!